Ever wondered how automatic streetlights work or how the solar light detectors function? Well, there's a little component called the Light Dependent Resistor, or LDR for short, that plays a crucial role. The LDR relies on light to vary its electrical resistance. Think of it like this. When there's high current, resistance is low, and when there's low current, the resistance is high. So, in simple terms, LDR is a component that has a resistance that changes with the light intensity that falls upon it. Now, you might be wondering, how does this magic happen? How does the LDR work? Well, sit tight as we unravel the mystery of the light-dependent resistor. The LDR operates on a principle known as photoconductivity, which is all about getting excited. Picture this. In a semiconductor, there are electrons hanging out in the valence band. These electrons want to move to the conduction band to start conducting electricity, but they're a bit depleted and can't make the jump on their own. Enter light energy, the external source of photons that these electrons need. When light, which is full of photons, hits the semiconductor, the electrons absorb this energy and get excited. This excitement gives them the boost they need to jump up into the conduction band, increasing the conductivity of the semiconductor. So when there's low light, there's less excitement leading to less conductivity or high resistance. On the other hand, when there's more light, there's a lot of excitement leading to high conductivity or low resistance. It's like a party. The more light, the more energy and the better the conduction. But remember, not all semiconductors are party animals. Only special types, like those made from materials such as cadmium sulfide or cadmium selenide, can take light as input and vary the resistance. And that's how the LDR works, transforming light into electrical resistance. Now that we know how LDR works, let's see where we can find this genius at work. LDRs are everywhere around us, playing a vital role in our daily lives. One of the most common applications is in automatic street lights. When the sun goes down, the LDR's resistance increases, which triggers the lights to switch on. As dawn breaks, light hits the LDR, decreasing its resistance, and the lights switch off. Isn't that smart? Similarly, LDRs are used in solar light detectors, adjusting the panel's angle for optimal sunlight exposure. They also play a crucial role in safety devices like fire and burglar alarms. In the absence of light, the LDR triggers the alarm, alerting us to potential danger. One of the best things about LDRs is their cost-effectiveness. Despite their significant applications, they are relatively cheap, making them a preferred choice in many devices. So next time you see an automatic streetlight, remember, it's the LDR at work making our lives easier and safer. So to wrap things up, we've learned about the light-dependent resistor, often referred to as an LDR. This remarkable little device varies its electrical resistance based on the level of light it's exposed to, a principle known as photoconductivity. It's this ability that makes it a key player in devices like automatic streetlights, solar light detectors, and various alarm systems. Isn't it amazing how such a small component can have such a big impact? That's the magic of LDR for you.